Tonight is Halloween, and we know that many of you are going to be making your way around the Metroplex looking for candy. Yeah, but for those of you in Irving, you may stumble upon one home not only giving away treats, but asking for something in return. Nicole Nielsen takes you to the Pirate's Pantry. It's a place combining spooky seasons with the season of giving. Any holiday, we love to decorate. A place where haunted pirates roam the high seas. Skeletons guard treasure chests, and a towering pirate ship beckons all who dare to approach. You know, the neighbors love it, the kids love it. It's also the same place where the community can give back. It was her idea, she wanted to do pirate ship, and I couldn't just leave it alone at pirate ship. <laughs> And I said, we're turning it into a food drive. Melissa Gentry has been an Irving resident for over 40 years and says she's seen firsthand the good that Irving Crisis Ministries does, a social services organization that she says was a no-brainer to choose to help. Their Halloween display operates as the Pirate's Pantry, collecting food items for those in need. We were looking for uh, Thanksgiving and dinner, non-perishable food items. Um, We've collected 366 pounds so far. And the community has stepped up, donated, and loved it. They're just like, thank you so much for doing this. This is so awesome. And they've just been really appreciative of it. Every visitor delighted at their massive handmade pirate ship. People's um, favorite part really has been the mass. They think that's pretty cool how we got the guy up there. And surrounded by the spirit of giving. If you'd like to donate to the Pirate's Pantry, tonight is the last opportunity to do so. The home is located on Brock Bank Drive in Irving. Nicole Nielsen, CBS News, Texas.